I'm not from Valencia, but they are. Ah. They, if you want, I translate what oh, you're saying and they, very nice. they tell. Cool, that's wow. good. We're just interested if people are um, about the sailing club, if they are interested in it or they don't care about it. They're very interested in American Ska because they are interested in the, the world of sailing. Mm -hmm. The ships models, international class international. competitions. Mm -hmm. yes. mm -hmm. this, uh, Models of ships are an international ah, class yes. uh, for competition. They are sponsored by BMW, the, yes. the cars, uh, well, you, you uh -huh. know, the German uh, car on Oracle. Mm -hmm. the informatic Una system. rosa también. Una rosa. Uh, Una rosa? It's another uh, trademark uh -huh. that sponsors competition. And what do they think about the people who come here, the tourists and so on? They are interested in the sailing club or? Um, they like the uh, tourists and people to come to Valencia to know this. They say it's good for the sport of sail, mm -hmm. sailing. It's a city with contrasts. On the one hand, you have all these old buildings, like little rotten, and on the other hand, you have these buildings from La Brava, the famous architecture. We are here still in Cabanyal and we see um, some of the houses which are sold and now the Romas live here and um, yeah that's a typical other view of Valencia. And now we see a lot of free spaces because everything is rotten and the old houses are not protected. It's the last fish village in Europe within a city. And we met Enrique, uh, the owner of a bar who lives here for uh, the last two years, ten years in Spain. And he told us about two firms in Valencia, Cabanyal 2010 and Aumsa. And these are two building firms in Valencia. He knows since two years that outside in this little village there will be built an avenida which um, yeah, kills all the, the shops and the, the, the houses here and the bars. And he couldn't believe it because these were really um, old buildings and um, another uh, kind of buildings than the others we saw before and he couldn't believe that um, one would destroy these buildings. The European Justice Court in Brussels decided that these firms are illegal. The firms, the practice of these firms is they bought uh, the houses in Cabanyal from the people out of the barrier who got the minimum prices for their houses. And they put Sintis and Romas inside without electricity and um, they didn't do anything to restore these houses or put them in better conditions. He said about that that can't live together. The, uh, on the one hand, the development of um, the modern buildings and the old ones. The people in Cabanyal are not well educated and they don't know uh, what to do and they needed the money and so they sold these houses. Uh, within the last few years, more or less, few years, all these houses we saw outside uh, are going to be destroyed because no one restores them and um, that is exactly the aim of these two firms and to build a great avenida which leads to um, Las Arenas. Las Arenas is a hotel where all the people for the American Cup and the rich visitors come. Because the European Justice Court in Brussels decided that these films are illegal, uh, they told this decision to Moratinos, which is the minister of Valencia, but uh, he didn't do anything against these firms. Okay, that's the problem here in Valencia.